So our 2007 baseball season takes us to the Arizona Fall League Championship today. The Phoenix Desert Dogs against the Surprise Rafters. Um, for some reason, the Phoenix Desert Dogs are again vying for the Fall League title. It's a beautiful sunny day the week before Thanksgiving here in Scottsdale, Arizona. A decent crowd, not a huge crowd, as we see some of the best from the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Um, other teams on the Surprise Raptors, I think, are Kansas City playing the Phoenix Desert Dogs, which has such future stars as Andrew McCutcheon and players from the Pirates and the Twins, etc. And we are just actually a few minutes away from game time as the players loosen up. All right, so we're just about a minute here from the opening of the game. Fernando Rodriguez of the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim is on the hill for the Surprise Raptors. Um, this is not a pitcher's league. He's a relatively low draft pick, a young man out of El Paso, Texas, who's starting the game today. He's had a pretty good fall league, if I remember seeing in some of the stats, and he's going to be facing Niger Morgan of the Pittsburgh Pirates, who had a cup of coffee with the Pirates this year. A young man, I'm going to see if we can find him here, who um, there he is, from San Francisco, played in the minors, and then um, came up and had a little bit of a cup of coffee. He, Appears to be good buddies with Andrew McCutcheon, fellow pirate. Hopefully they'll be uh, reaching the show about the same time. And we're about to capture the first pitch here of the 2007 Arizona Fall League Championship game. I think this marks the fourth or fifth consecutive game that we've been at. And we've seen some of the greatest players in uh, Fall League history who have gone on to make it to the major leagues. About 20 feet from where we're sitting, we met the parents of Houston Street, we've seen Ryan Howard, and so on and so forth. So Morgan's stepping in against Fernando Rodriguez, and the first pitch of the 2007 Arizona Fall League is about to come right here. And he gets that one, and the game is underway as Morgan is steaming around first, around second. And he goes head first into third where he is out. Trying to stretch a double into a triple. You're never supposed to make the first or third out at third base. And he broke the cardinal rule and it's one out. So we're in the bottom of the first. The um, Phoenix Desert Dogs, the defending champions, scored on a, uh, I would call it an error. It was a fly ball to left field that was dropped. Nick Blackburn, the Minnesota Twins, is on the hill for the Desert Dogs, and Jose Duarte, an undrafted player who was out of Venezuela from the Kansas City Royals, is up in the bottom of the first, leading off for surprise rafters, and the score is 1-0. Okay, take a look at the first pitch here. Blackburn, again, as I said previously, it's not a pitcher's league. Blackburn, I think, is a low-round draft pick of the Twins, and the first pitch, it's a strike. The umpire leaves no margin for error there. All right, one of our featured players today is John Mayberry Jr., a first round draft pick a few years ago at a Stanford University by the Texas Rangers. We kind of figured his dad's got to be here. Of course, John Mayberry played first base for the Kansas City Royals. Pretty talented young man, a pretty tall right right fielder with a good arm and a power bat, of course. And he takes that one for a strike. Well, we've spotted this guy before and he is indeed a celebrity. That's Artie Moreno, the owner of the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Lost in it for a second. Hobnobbing with the crowd. He was uh, here, he was at the U of A game last week. He's a University of Arizona grad as he makes his way into the uh, Carter. That Okay, a little bit more celebrity spotting. We're guessing, but we're pretty sure that the guy on the left is John Mayberry Sr. His son just flew out to end the inning. He's playing right field for the rafters. Uh, not too many people know that, but the gentleman to his left is Mitchell Page, who was the batting coach for the Washington Nationals. I'm not sure what he's doing right now, but uh, that's who's sitting up there. 
And that's the ball game. Chris Levansky strikes out. And the final score is Phoenix Desert Dog 7, Surprise Raptors 2. And the, and the Surprise Raptors put up a valiant game until the very, very end, the last couple of innings, when the Desert Dogs exploded for five big runs. McCrory came in, a relief pitcher for the Baltimore Orioles, and then he throws hard. He got the final three outs, and the Phoenix Desert Dogs win yet another Arizona Fall League Championship. Seven runs on 15 hits. Game time is about, uh, I don't know, three hours, and we'll be seeing the trophy awarding in just a minute or so. Arizona Fall League prides itself on being a showcase league of next year's Major League players, and I don't think there's any doubt in anyone's mind what you saw today. There are many, many. It's the fourth consecutive year that the Phoenix Desert Dogs have won the championship, and they're very, very deserving. There's the banner. The 2007 Arizona Fall League championship pennant to the Phoenix Desert Dogs.